everyone, it's Fancy from Smart Money Moves. Want to know one habit that ultra successful people have in common? They read a lot. In fact, when Warren Buffett was once asked about the key to success, he pointed to a stack of nearby books and said, read 500 pages like this every day. That is how knowledge works. It builds up like compound interest. All you can do it, but I guarantee not many of us will do it. Buffett actually takes this habit to the extreme. He reads between 600 and 1000 pages per day when he was beginning his investing career and still devotes about 80% of each day to reading. And he's not alone. Bill Gates reads about 50 books per year, which breaks down to one book per week. Mark Cuban reads more than eight hours every day. Elon Musk, he's an avid reader. And when asked about how he learned to build rockets, he said, I read books. So here are the few top business leaders and entrepreneurs who make reading a major part of their daily lifestyle. But successful people don't just read anything. They are highly selective about what they read, opting to be more educated over entertained. Successful people tend to choose educational books and publications over novels, tabloids, and magazines. And in particular, they obsessed over biographies and autobiographies of other successful people for guidance and inspiration. I believe that books are a gateway to learning and knowledge. Whether reading is already a way of life for you or you're just getting started, here are five books for success to consider. Number one, Rich Dad, Poor Dad by Robert Kiyosaki. Here's a powerful book that changed my life. Rich Dad, Poor Dad by Robert Kiyosaki. This is one of the most popular finance book of all time. It really taught me about assets versus liability. It's also a very easy to read book that helps you with your mindset and your psychology around money. He basically shares the story of his rich dad and his poor dad. His poor dad was actually biological father who was a school teacher, but he was poor. His rich dad was actually his friend's dad and he was wealthy. Kiyosaki contrasts the difference between what the poor and the rich or the middle class teach their children. As a young man, Kiyosaki was taught by his poor dad to follow the path of least resistance, get an education, get a job, and work hard. His rich dad, which is his friend's father, mentored him to do the opposite. The book acknowledges something I always believed in, that education is important, but it isn't always the best receiving in a formal learning environment. Lessons includes the value of self-employment, how to be self-employed without limiting yourself to the constraint of an employee, and how to create and take advantage of residual income opportunities. Instead of traditional working hard for money, use the principle in this book to make money work for you. This is really a great book that teaches you about the fundamentals of money and the value of taking control of your financial destiny through entrepreneurship and investing. I think everyone should read this book. Number two, The Greatest Salesman in the World by G. Mendino. Another great book that has made a difference in my life is The Greatest Salesman in the World. This is a book that I recently reread. I read this book when I was only 18 years old. It's a classic self-help book and it really impacted me when I was 18 years old. This book is basically a fictional story about a boy who wants to become the greatest salesman in the world. He goes to the king and the king basically gives him the scrolls and these scrolls have the different success principle in order to be a successful salesman and to be wealthy and to live a great life. So the instruction is that he has to read one scroll three days a week for 30 days and he's got to really master and practice what is taught inside that scroll. So for example, the first scroll is on love and the power of love and how loving the day and loving people is one of the most important skill in being able to influence people and live a really great life. Basically throughout the book, you go on this journey and you're reading the scrolls, which is chapter three times a day, morning, noon, and before you go to bed. It really made a difference and impacted my life because I love books like that. I like books that don't just have a bunch of theories and knowledge, but that get you to actually shift your beliefs, your mindset, and your psychology. This is a great book that really forced me to practice these principles every day. Reading one scroll every day for 30 days allows you to master it completely. It's a powerful book. Number three, Think and Grow Rich by Napoleon Hill. This is one of the top books that I often recommend to people that has really made a difference in my life. It would be Think and Grow Rich by Napoleon Hill. Napoleon Hill was hired by Andrew Carnegie, who was the richest man in the world at the time. 
Andrew Carnegie and Napoleon Hill go out and study the most successful people in the world to find out what were the common traits and qualities that made people successful. He went and studied people like Henry Ford, Thomas Edison, and all these incredible people. The book basically has the best of the best principle of what it takes to succeed. Again, it's called Think and Grow Rich because success starts in your mind. It's your psychology and your mindset. I often say how 80% of success is your mindset, the way you think, whereas only 20% is the how-to and the mechanics. This is a fantastic book that really goes into the mindset and the psychology of success. And one of his famous quotes, such as, whatever the mind can conceive and believe it, it can achieve it, has changed the way millions of people view their lives. I highly recommend to read this timeless classic book by everyone interested in improving their life and reaching major goals. Number four, The 4-Hour Work Week. Another great book, The 4-Hour Work Week, has made an impact in my life because it made me believe in and realize the whole power of passive income lifestyle. Tim Ferriss does a fantastic job marketing and selling the idea of escaping the 9 to 5 and traveling the world and be able to enjoy your life in the process of building your business mindset. That really influenced me at the time and got me motivated to build online businesses and pursue it as a lifestyle. Beyond that, it also teaches you how to leverage yourself and how to leverage virtual assistant. The book also promotes the whole idea that you can outsource things inexpensively to other countries and have them help you build your businesses. This is a great book for anybody that has a 9 to 5 job and that wants to escape it and pursue the so-called internet lifestyle. Number 5. Magic of Thinking Big by David Swartz. Thinking Big separates the achievers from the average. In this best-selling classic, the author suggests that it is not necessarily intelligence or work ethic that move people up the ladder of success, but the personal choice that people make to believe that something bigger and better is possible. As the saying goes, believe you can and you will. Make time to reflect on your life's goal and expand them. Once you have a clear picture of what you want, focus your energy on achieving that goal, keep your eyes fixed on that goal, and do not allow small thinkings of the world around you to cloud your vision. The book offers practical advice for putting the magic of thinking big to work in your life. I hope this encourages you to find a book that interests you and carve out a few minutes every day to read at least a few pages. You'll be amazed at the difference it will make in your journey towards success. So if you enjoyed this video, please, please make sure to subscribe to my channel for videos every Tuesdays and Fridays. Also make sure to hit that like button.